how Colorado Senator Cory Gardner will respond if, as expected, President Trump nominates a new Supreme Court justice this week. Today, protesters were gathered outside Gardner's Denver office urging him not to vote until after the November election. The death of Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg has triggered a political fight over who should name her replacement. Tonight, we have Gardner's answer. In a statement, the senator says, I have and will continue to support judicial nominees who will protect her constitution, not legislate from the bench, and uphold the law. Should a qualified nominee who meets this criteria be put forward, I will vote to confirm. Well, Gardner stand now in stark contrast to his comments in 2016 following the passing of Justice Antonin Scalia. When President Obama announced a nominee, Gardner and many other Republicans said the Senate should not hold a confirmation vote until after that year's presidential election. Said Gardner, then, our next election is too soon and the stakes are too high. The American people deserve a role in this process as the next Supreme Court justice will influence the direction of this country for years to come. That was nearly eight months before that election. Gardner's opponent, former Governor John Hickenlooper, said this evening in 2016, Senator Gardner set a clear standard that the people should have a voice in the selection of the next Supreme Court justice. But now he broke it to stand with the president at the expense of Colorado, as he's done 100% of the time.